Hello everybody, welcome back to the Nocturnal Gaming Network, my name is Zira, and today on this moonlit night, we're playing Assassin's Creed Black Flag. So, the last time we were together, we went to some random island, and we were having a retirement party for our old friend, Thatch, Blackbeard. And, you know, we were sort of, um, sort of ambushed at the party, and the party was ruined, and Thatch died. And that's terrible. So, today, we're gonna catch up with our old friend here. And since this is the Ranger, I'm pretty sure that that is, uh, Ben Hornigold? But it could be the other guy, uh, Charles Vane. We'll have to, you know... We'll have to check it out and figure out which one of them it is. So let's go. Let's uh, just, you know, kind of get right in there. Van Glorious Bastards. So it is vain. So Thatch has been chopped. Fuck's sake. He was outnumbered. Couldn't reach him. Devil damn the man he was fierce, but his heart was divided. It's hard to let go of the life you know best. Uh, my own idiot father liked to brag about how he meant to purchase a ship of his own. I'll get a privateering contract, Charlie. Your old dad will be a captain. Huh. Drowned in a whiskey bottle before he ever left show. Hmm. Right, Kenway. I've been musing on this plan of yours. This observatory you're always going on about. How do we know it exists? We find a slave ship called the Princess. Aboard should be a man called Roberts. He can lead us to it. All them slavers work for the Royal African Company. Find one of their ships and start asking some questions. Hmm. All right. So we are looking for the Royal African Company. The name. What's our course, Captain? We're looking for slave ships. Any that work for the Royal African Company. You don't mean to traffic human cargo now, do you? No, Jesus, Addy. You know me better than that. That did sort of escalate Only quickly. Information. Looking to find where the princess docks in her spare time. The princess. Slave ship. Right. Blackbeard told me there's a good chance we'd find the sage aboard her. Hmm. So, how come Vane... Oh, Vane's gonna go pirating. I see. I was gonna say, how come Vane can go right through them? But, you know. Can't that animal stay the course we agreed to? Apparently not. Okay, we got another little teeny tiny ship over there somewhere. Oh, is that, is that a bigger ship? It is a bigger ship. That's like a frigate or something. But it's not somewhere I think I have to worry about. Why is his brig faster than mine? I feel like my brig should be the fastest brig on the sea. Even though mine doesn't really look like a brig. I don't have the extra sails up. Actually, I don't have the extra sails off the side. That's probably why his is faster than mine. Hmm. So slow. I feel like he's going to get in trouble and we're going to have to like go rescue him or something. Let's follow him. Let's follow uh Vane over here. Look at harpooning target. I don't want to go harpooning right now. What are these guys? Fire barrels, some wood and some sugar. Alright. We got something else over here. 
he stopped, so maybe this is our ship. Frigate, Royal African Pearl. Don't sing that slaver ship, She's boats, Captain. This a slaver ship is running. What are you doing? Ooh. I'll get us in close. All right, so now I guess we need to board the ship. Really? Awaiting your mark, Captain. Fire! All right. Damn that Captain Vin. He's unloading everything he has. He'll sink it if he's not careful. We'll get closer. Fire! Fire! Come on, Vane. Cut it out. Don't make me shoot at you. I'll drop a mortar on you. Where is he? Can I do that? I don't. Know. I probably shouldn't do that. Come on, we need to go faster. Right. Vane, cut it out. Oops, I think I hit him. I did hit him. Ha ha ha! I didn't really mean to. I'm taking us close. Oh, we need to rescue him. Board, boys! Fast as you are! All clear! Pull away! Okay, so now we get some extra pirates cluttering up our, uh... ...with an upgraded man. Use the fort's defenses to sink a ship. Okay, we have used the fort's defenses to sink the ship. We can use our fort to our advantage. Already done. Board the ship. Okay. Ship boarded. What do we need to do? We need to destroy their powder. We can do that right now. Please. Ah ha ha. I'll get the captain. Boy, my uh, fort did a number on whatever ship it was that got close. Okay, board guys. Hi there. Should probably take out my swords for this one, huh? Okay. I want the captain for myself. I don't think I'm gonna get him. I I got him. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so we have got this royal African princess or something. This captain claims the princess sails out of Kingston every few months. All right, we'll say of course. Yo, made ash on my sails and rigging jackanapes. You owe me a share. Oh, oh damn it, Vane! Oh, Charles, what a surly devil you are. Don't fuck with me, Jack. Oh, it's my mandate to fuck with you, Charles. <laughs> Lads? Ah, see, <clears throat> the boys and I had a bit of counsel while you were wasting time with this slot. And, um, well, they figured I'd be a fitter captain than you reckless dogs. <laughs> I'll cut you another cut, try oh. sir. <laughs> this one I figure I might sell for a... Tenor, down in Kingston, but uh, with you two grog blossoms, I can't take any chances. You regret this day, Rackham. I regret most of them already. Tie them up. Cast them off. So, he's taking. taking my ship. Huh? I'll cut uh, you, okay. Jack Rackham! I'll open you up! I'll tear out your organs! And string your bloody loot with them! Stop your goddamn howling vein! There's no bloody use! Well, well! The face of our good Kenway speaks, eh? Pray tell us, Captain, how to quit this predicament. And tell us what genius you have for sailing a boat with no sails and no rudder! Shut your gob! Hmm. Uh. 
Okay, so... So we have been mutinied. This is... This is not good. Apparently we're on a ship with no sails and no rudder. We're in the middle of the water, and we have Vane to deal with. So what have we found? We found an island? Ooh. Keep still now. I'll take these oysters you've ordered. You mad sap. This island's crawling with food, if only you'd care to look for it. Yeah, I am looking, louts. Oh, some just there. <laughs> what are you gonna do with that Don't. stick? Don't come following now. Do you hear me? Don't come looking for me. Wretched fool. Alright. So... We're on an island. We need to skin three animals. Let's start by climbing up to the top of this. Please, Edward, climb. Thank you. I hear something twinkling. Is it treasure? Is it the treasure sparkling in the sunlight? Is that what that is that I hear? I don't see it yet. I see it on the map, but I don't see it. There's one. The other one's over there somewhere. Hmm. Alright, so where are we? Isla Providencia. Alright. So we got some monkeys inland. Red howler monkeys. Okay, and then we've got... Oh, a Mayan stele. And another viewpoint there. So there's nothing down here along the beach. Good. Uh, wow, three... Three viewpoints. Okay. I guess while we're right here, we'll get some bullets. Those will be very helpful. Um, area not available. That's fine. I can get this bottle. What's in the bottle? So, okay. Have to read those at some point. So, when they cast us off, did they take our equipment and just happen to forget about all of my equipment? I don't have any... I have, I have a throwing knife, and I have my hidden blades, huh? Okay. Hey, here's the other treasure. That's what was twinkling. Good. Pearl earrings. That's going to be so helpful for getting off this island. I, I have a feeling. All right, we've got to go inland. Where is Charles Fane? I need animals to skin to complete my secondary objective, huh? There's some treasure over here. Oh, 
there's something. Hi there, Mr. Monkey. Oh, do I not? I don't have a pistol, huh? Well, how am I gonna skin animals if I don't have a pistol? Can I... Can I jump up in the tree here? No. He disappeared. Okay. Maybe Vane counts as an animal, and when I skin him, I, <laughs> I get my three. Where is he? Okay, so I need to head around this way next. We have some jaguars. Black jaguars, huh? Okay, that's good. Crocodiles in the water? I don't see any. Ooh. Hello, kitty. There's one animal. I am really surprised that I got that one. But whatever. Are there any more hiding right around here? No, I don't see any, and I need to get up to there, so... Uh, uh, how can I get up there? This tree over here? Yes, right here. Okay. Any other jaguars around here? Charles Vane is around here somewhere. I need some more Don't Jaguars. This island's mine! Come at me, and I'll cap you, bastard! It was your bloody imagination that landed us here, Kenway! I'll be damned if I let that mind make one more decision for me! Will you not talk to me, Vane? Are you fixed on this madness? Madness? <laughs> Nothing mad about a man fighting to survive, is there? I mean you no harm, you corker! <laughs> now let's work this out like gentlemen. Oh, God! I've got a bleeding headache on account of your jabbering. Now stay back and let me live in peace. I would if you stop filching the food I gather and the water I find. I'll stop nothing till you pay me back in blood. You was the reason we were out looking for slavers. And you was the reason Jack Rackham took my crew. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um... So, he's blaming it on us. And I feel like we aren't going to be able to just change his mind here. So, yeah, let's, let's see. How do we want to do this? We need to get up there. Probably want to go over this way or something. Oh, there's... Some treasure over there, huh? Treasure there. Alright, I think we should start with this treasure here. Find Charles Fane. He's right there, isn't he? Yeah, he's, he's right there. Okay, let's... I like how he's just sitting there letting us take our time and spin the <laughs> magical invisible lines in our head. Oop, I missed it. That's right, yeah.
Aha! Good. Another keystone. Alright, let's climb up there now. So there are two Mayan stones on this island. I feel like he's going to start shooting at us any second now. Oh! What did he do? Did he jump into the water? Face me, man. He did. He's going downstream. Alright, so we need to find Charles Vane again. But first, let's see if there's any more treasure he's ignoring in this island. Looks like we got one more chest. We got some jaguars down river. And some crocodiles over there. Okay. Um. So. Can I go do anything over here? There's another viewpoint on this island. Okay. I can't do anything over here. So I'm going to jump and probably die. Yep. <laughs> I had a bad angle. Okay. We can just go down here this time. Now, we got treasure over on this side. Alright. Right up here. One more level up, maybe. Right there. Maybe we should share the treasure with Vane. Maybe that would make him come to his senses. Although at this point, I don't know that it would. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. It should be Jaguar somewhere. Ooh, a crocodile. That's... That's going to go over well. Alright, let's see. We just have one crocodile right there. Let's see if I can air assassinate it. Please. No. Got it. Uh oh. I just... I... <laughs> He'll be back. No, he won't. I got him. I want to kill this crocodile. What was that? What are you doing over there, Vane? Come on! Get him, Edward! Get him! Can I not kill the crocodile? I don't think I can kill the crocodile. Oh, and it got me. Alright, so. Crocodile cannot be killed. I don't know why. I feel like it's no different than any other time. When I'm trying to kill it. You know? Maybe a throwing knife. I'm gonna try the throwing knife. I just hope I can retrieve the throwing knife after I use it on the crocodile. Alright, I gotta make sure that... Uh -oh. I don't seem to be able to. Okay. So we'll leave him alone. And we should be coming into the Jaguar area soon, right? Oh, no, the Jaguar area is gone. It's over there, back there. Um, hmm. I said not to follow! Jesus, you've lost your head, man! It's a fair exchange for finding these flintlocks and grenados. Listen, Vane, we can hunt with those guns. <laughs> and I mean so! 
All right. So my new objective is to catch Charles Vane. Uh oh. I'm stuck in some water here. No escaping me! No? No escaping you? I don't think I can get up here this way. That was a pretty decent throw there. Alright, let's go this way. Okay, he cannot see me. No, you're not dead yet? Is it just a flesh wound? Oh, okay. Catch Charles Fane. Where is he? I'm done with him. You and your bloody fairy stories got into this mess, can we? Fairy stories? If I let you drag me into another, you keep this up, and I'll have to kill you, Fane. Bloody try. By all means. There's a jaguar. Ooh. Okay. Ha ha! Gotcha. Alright, so we got some bones and some jaguar pelt. I need one more jaguar. Or a actually anything. I don't care if it's necessarily a jaguar. I feel like it's a bad idea to be wandering really close to those things. I see yep. you coming, Kerr. I see you plain and clear. Apparently he sees us. Ooh. Is that a jaguar? I feel like that's a jaguar over there. No. No, it's just sticks. Sort of failed a little bit. Alright, we got another crocodile. Aha! Uh -huh. There's a map somewhere. Another jaguar. Okay. Um. So. Let's see if I can get back up into, like, this tree. Nope, it's coming for me. Here, kitty, kitty. Be, be good, kitty. Okay. We got our third animal skin. Where is he? He's up there. We've got some treasure. Some more treasure right up here. And we've got a treasure map down with that crocodile. There. So there's the crocodile. I feel like the crocodile had to do with this guy's uh, demise. Okay, so... Veins between me and the next viewpoint. Let's just sort of head over here. I hope I didn't miss something. I don't want to have to come back. I probably am not going to come back. Alright, where is he? He's up top. There he is. It's either you or me who's leaving this island alive, Welcher! Because I'm not going to sail again in a world cursed by your ugly boat! So, what is this? Some sort of naval fort that he's managed to air assassinate. Right, so he's like taking over a fort. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, that was a good shot. There we go. I don't know where it went, but I'm just gonna. Sort of wait. Okay. Alright. Okay. 
right. Um, I don't know. Oh no! Oh no! Run, Edward! <laughs> no escaping you, huh? I feel like you have no idea where I am, Charles. I'll flush you out. Bloody rags will be all that's left of you, can't we? Okay. So I can't get up that way, but I'm supposed to air assassinate him, so how do I want to do this? Can I jump over to here? No, there's nothing I can climb onto. Maybe right here. I'll blow you to hell! That's not nice, Vane. After all we've been through, can't just like talk no about this, please. Me. You can't hide, can we? I think I can hide, actually. Because you have no idea where I am. I'll flush you out. Oh, maybe he does know where I am. Blow off some limbs. Wonder, wonder if I should try and synchronize. Yeah, let's synchronize and see what happens. I bet he's gonna hit me with like that grenade or something while I'm just sitting here. I'll flush you out. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. He knows I'm here too. Look at him. Go away, Vane. I'm done with you. You goddamn fucking A, Vane! <laughs> Nancy boy. You've only done half the fucking job. Fucking hell. Is this my reward for believing the best about men? For thinking that a bilge rat like you could muster up some fucking sense once in a while? Maybe... Horner Gold was right. Maybe the world does need men of ambition to stop the likes of you from mucking it all up. <laughs> or maybe you just don't have the stones to live with no regrets. <laughs> don't save me a spot in hell, Shanker. I ain't coming soon. You're just leaving him, Edward? I feel like that's a bad idea. Who's this? Okay. Interesting. So, it appears we have made our way off of the island and are heading somewhere are we gonna pilot that little teeny tiny ship now do we have to start all over with our upgrades I hope not actually this is a rather long loading I Zone. Are we getting pulled out of the Animus? No. Not yet, at least. We have made it to the Grain and Guna. Single-handed. Damn canny, Captain. As is taking back my break from this pillock. Once again, I thank you both. This Billy Huff didn't last two months with your ship before he came limping back to Nassau. Took the pardon straight away. I had to, lads. That Rogers was on to me from the first. Hold your tongue, Rackham. Hmm. So what now? Still chasing your elusive fortune? Aye, and I'm close. I've heard the sage is sailing out of Kingston on a ship called the Princess. Put your ambition to better use, Kenway. Find the sage with us. I've no stomach for you and your mystics, Mary. I want a taste of the good life. An easy life. 
No one honest has an easy life, Edward. And it's aching for one that causes the most pain. Huh. All right, Rackham. Back to retirement. So what are we doing with Rackham? That can't be comfortable. It's just he's just laying on the Can I step I'm <laughs> Okay. Um now that I've stepped through his chest, I'm just gonna move away here. Um hmm. So we're back on our island. Where were we? We were on this one here. The Isla Providencia. We have a couple chests and we have stuff here. Okay. Maybe we'll go back there. Probably not. But uh, next time when we return, I guess we're going to get back up on our ship. And we are going to head out to somewhere. I think we're heading back to Kingston. Kingston is down here. Yeah. Kingston. And I, I guess we're going to this random part of the streets. And, well, we do have a lot of stuff. Like, there's viewpoints over here. I have no idea what that is. There's something here. A manuscript. Oh, boy. There's all sorts of stuff. So, next time when we return, we will be heading to Kingston. So, thank you all so much for watching. My name's Zira, and this is the Nocturnal Gaming Network bringing you Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Have yourselves a wonderful night, everybody.